Hello friends, how's everybody doing? It's your friend Jeff playing Ultimate General Civil War. Alright, we're in the North Campaign. I got this core here is my best core. And this core here is Ulysses Grant and it's basically, you know, the majority is a bunch of rookies. And we, and I don't know the changes that were made in this, but I am going to find out. And we're right here. Their, their army is that. And we get a minus five enemy army size. All right, let's see what this is going to be like. 20 and 10. All right, well, it looks like an even fight. But what changes were made? Let's see. Okay, the rebels are pursuing us. We're down on Gaines Mill. Yep, yep. Yeah, that's that's normal. Okay, pause. Menu, save. B G North. Um, ten, I think it is. Start. All right, so we got that saved now also oh, now we're way over here okay so in the other battles we used to be somewhere over here and we withdraw okay so this is a all right so this is a big change right here and oh all right so i have first second and third divisions. Hmm. Okay. Well. Okay. So I just gotta. I just gotta absorb this for a moment. Hmm. Let me see here. All right. Well. Uh. We would have to race to. Yeah. I don't think I could. Cause see, when we're over here, we could we could set up like right in this area here. I don't think that's going to be possible anymore. Um, hmm. All right. Well, the first thing while I'm thinking about this, let me just let me do what I would normally do, which is to break every unit. Because um, and now that I have all these, wow, OK, so we, we get them all at once. Um, hmm, that's interesting. <laughs> OK, so. All right. Um, I like to put a skirmisher. Well, now I have to do this, right? Um, you go there. All right, I'm going to need somebody there. 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 Somebody there. And... Okay, yeah, and then somebody right here. Okay, so that's that. Now I'm gonna need guns. Like I, we gotta. Tr I mean, well, maybe if we, maybe if we try to get over here, then maybe. Um, yeah, let me. All right, look, you guys. You guys try to get there. You guys try to get there. You guys try to get, yeah, I don't know, maybe, and then you guys over there. This gun can go over there, maybe. Um, and 
then. Yeah, if we can get the guns over there. Now, I don't know if they're going to, like, if 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 the, if the enemy is going to, and ammo should go over there, but I don't know if the enemy is going to uh, get my cab too. But, I mean, I don't know if the enemy is going to be planted over here or not. Or are they, uh, or is it going to be normal, normal, like they come from this way here first? Then later on, they might come from here. But, uh, yeah, I don't really know. And so at least um, my general. All right, well, let's assume that we could uh, take four units to go over here to hold that if, you know, that is that. And then if I take two units to head this way, and that's, that's four and two, and that leaves me two to go here for now to make sure we can hold this. And I think we can just let it go because uh, I, I don't know because I've never seen it this way where we get all this line right here so that's totally new to me and um, so I don't know if this is going to work out and because and, like I said when we start over here it's easy to come it's easy to either set up over here then have these guys like you get a couple of guys there would be like maybe what would there be like a line of six here or something or i don't know if it was a line of eight but whatever it was i know i know we have a line right here and then we'd have a line right here and so i'd put the skirmishers all around here and then i'd send all the units to fight them like sometimes i would I w these units would come over here to fight the initial guys and I could push them and I can hold the line right here and then the reinforcements that we have oh yeah see they're already here so there's no alright well look you and you after him so they're already across well, yeah so there's no way of getting up here Uh, you two shoot him. You get over there. We gotta it, we gotta at least slow them. So yeah, so maybe maybe I could get some units up here, maybe. Come on now, you gotta get in the in there, you gotta get over there and help out. You got to get over here to help out. And Bruce, you were supposed to go over that way. Donya, Bruce. I missed him. He came, he came all the way back. Oh, what an idiot. All right, so we might not... Be, I don't know what kind of defense I can make here, but I'm gonna try to do something. All right, you're gonna have to get up in here. Send my cab. Yeah, you gotta get here to shoot at that skirmisher right there. Yeah, I don't know how this is gonna go. And don't, and don't forget, I still got splits on, and I know I don't get no reinforcements, so I don't like that, but I'm gonna allow it for now. But in these grand battles where I don't get, um, rein you know, allies, if it becomes too hard, yeah, I'm gonna have to 
I need these two units up here too. Okay, now you are supposed to fall back, moron, so that way my infantry unit can shoot. They're gonna they're gonna come to try to harass my my uh, my cavalry. <laughs> Let's see. Okay, well, like I said, I do have these going up there, so we gotta we gotta push this. There's somebody hiding in there. I mean, we only got an hour, but. So he's gonna come over here to, oh! Look at they already have stuff coming across. All right, come on guys, over here. Son of a gun. Let's go. Let's go. Are right, you off the flag? Get over here. They've already they already have somebody coming across. Oh, man. Oh, you! Hey, uh, fall back. I didn't see him, I'm sorry. Okay, so then... I don't know why you two went ahead of the infantry. We were set up. You guys, gosh, fall back, please. Fall back. My goodness.
Yeah, like I said, I, I don't... Come on, move forward. You gotta engage that guy right there. Ah, uh, he's, he's gonna shoot my cab. I gotta get out of there. Of course we don't have any any artillery over here, but alright now you guys Alright, let's See, got a skirmisher right here. I don't know what else is going on in the battle at the moment, but...
All right, we got him. Nice. All right, so we captured that guy up there and we captured the supplies. Now let's see what's going on over here. I'm gonna tell him to go out. I want to see which way he goes. Cause if he goes up here and they get they get reinforcements, you know, and said he was a he he was a split. I'll find a way to try to get that gun right there. Oh boy. All right, I'm moving a gun over here for support. Oh, nice. 
Alright, now we're gonna... I don't know if this is going to work out, but I'm going to give it a try. Okay, so... Yes, it's not... It's probably not a good idea for the guy who did the melee in, because he's now out of condition. Uh, this guy should be okay. And I'm going to try to get him and... Yeah, figures my cavalry got hurt. I got th all three infantry shooting at him, plus my gun. Can you? Oh, yeah, gun is gone. The gun is gone. Oh, okay, so rebels continue to attack. Uh, they're going to come from here. Okay, so we're going to move this gun over, and if, let's see, 
if we want to if we want to kind of move move back a little bit because if they got more reinforcements coming Yeah. Kinda hard to know where the gun should be. Yeah, I don't know, because they might try to sneak along here, and... Alright, so what I'm going to do is, like I said, I'm trying to make a line here to fight these guys. And I'm trying to... Because i, I got to figure out what they're going to do. Like, I, I have no clue. Like, I put here because I thought they would come up this way. But if they're, gonna, if they're all going to mass down here or something, I, I don't know. So maybe I'll move the gun over here. Alright, and like I said, I have I have two of these infantry units trying to get out of here. And I hope they don't get anybody that can, like a cavalry come down here and get these two. Because that would really bite to have them behind my lines. So. so yeah, so what happened to this wing that came down from here? You know, like where are they hiding? They're going to mass somewhere and then mass charge us. I'm just checking all their ammo. Yeah, 
Yeah, so I'm, uh, I'm really hoping that these two that we captured can get out of here. And I do have their supply wagon right here, so... That way I can supply over here. This gun needs to be able to shoot at them. Alright, so it says... It, sa it shows over here, so he's probably coming here to attack. Oh, whoa, they're behind us. All right, let's go. They're behind us. Where's my cab? Okay, so they must have came from up here then. That's another trick by JMP. Yeah, because they used to they used to spawn here, the first wave, the second wave, the third wave, the fourth wave along with the fourth wave coming this way is the way they would come in the past but now they don't so Okay, we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna send the majority of them because if if that group didn't come, they came from this way, then that's you know that's a that's a little trick that JP made. <laughs> okay, so oh yeah yeah. Well, I'll tell you what though, my cavalry just took out two of their, their, um, two of their, um, artillery units. Hey, and there's a supply wagon right there. Let me see if I can get him to go get that. Or could my cav head that way too to get that, maybe. And they got one, two, three, four, yeah. So I'm wondering if this is the wave that should have came this way on us, but it, it, it ain't gonna happen that way. So now I gotta leave one unit here, one unit here, one unit here. I gotta keep at least these guys here. Maybe I could pull, maybe I can pull one unit out of there. But this gun has to keep those guys busy, and this gun has to keep them busy, I guess. That's about all I can do, I believe. Uh, so, you know, if they get this, but I, I'm, you know, so when will my last wave of, inf you know, like whatever, we'll see how this goes. I can see if I can try to recover from this. Yeah, because the only thing, you know, with this surprise here, um, at least I saw the, 
You know, I, I can't believe that their artillery was here and my one cab took out both of them. But, 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 you know, like I said, my guys are coming, so... Alright, so all my skirmishes are going to have to, the ones that are 125 are going to have to move in over there too to help out. Alright, we got their supply wagon. I mean, this guy is going to, you know... All right, guys, it's nice to sh sit and shoot, but you guys got to keep moving. All right, come on, guys. Oh, great. I didn't even know. Th I didn't even know that these guys came. So, all right. Skirmishes over there. Infantry. Let's go ahead and bust these two up. Let's get some uh, skirmishers over there. Let's get an infantry there and one to take that flag. And this gun, the 20, can go right on that right there. And it looks like he's going to go out. And I hope the other guy already went out. So we will have at least, you know, whatever that was, um, yeah, maybe about 1,500 uh, prisoners. All right, so let's see what else is going on here in the battle. All right, let's go ahead and continue. Yeah. 
Yeah, he thought he was cool sitting over here shooting and them flanking us. Oh, he dissolved. Well, that's that's good. It's one less unit to have to deal with now. Move over here. Move over here. Move up here. Let's go. Come on, guys. Keep moving. It's going to take forever for these guys to get into the battle. I figure those two uh, can, you know, make them think about it while these guys try to... Matter of fact, I'm probably going to need both of these infantry somewhere over here anyway. Yeah, I, and I got these guys just sitting there. All right, let's get the ammo over here. If I could just get that twenty pounder there, he can he can be shooting. this tell you folks but let's go ahead and I 
like I don't know what other I don't know what other surprises are coming from the JP mod, but we'll see. Figures lost. I lost a colonel. Oh, he's just wounded, but still. Now his unit's gonna be like crap for right now. Yeah, you gotta watch your skirmish guys, because he, he was gonna follow that guy, and this guy would have just plowed right into him. Move the 20 pounder a little bit closer. Alright, I gave everybody targets to go after, so that will set those guys. Now it seems like... Hey, so they, they got 14 guns. I gotta go look for those guns. Alright, it might be good for you to get right there, and for you to get right there. Now you shoot him. You shoot him until he gets in there.
Oh oh. Oh oh. Oh oh. I mean, he thought... <laughs> yeah. I know you guys are tired, but you gotta fight. I mean, it's just the way it is. I know they gotta have a gun over here or something. But they have an infantry that was slow behind, so I had to get... Oh no, they still got two more right there. They still got two more right here. And they split. Another split out there. Uh, you're in the, I think, let me see, yeah, you're in the woods, but you're not. Get in the woods, please. Okay. Well, we got ourselves a third supply wagon. Yeah, but we're just gonna have to get out of here. They just spawned more right here. Another split. Why every time they spawn they get extra splits? That's why, you know, I don't like having the splits on, but whatever. Man. It's like every wave they got a split. I mean I thought you're supposed to only have like a percentage of it, like not not every every wave's supposed to get a split. Yes. Like I said, if you gave that to the player, boy, imagine me having all double units. I could have more coverage of, of the whole map. <laughs> See, and they're deciding if they should try to go after that supply wagon. That's why I'm telling both of them to go hide in the woods. And if all the infantry can get past these, these, then I'm gonna come down and kill those things.
I don't know when I'm gonna get my last reinforcements. See, I figure with one gun here and one gun there, um, if that's holding them off, then that's fine. We can always withdraw to this line if we have to. So whatever I get over here has got to fight this up here, boy. Cause there's quite a bit right here. Give them all targets. Alright, so he's got 300 kills. How much does this guy have? Woods. Only 81. That's not... It's not a good ratio there. Woods... I don't know why Woods don't have a good count. Okay, well, I got my 20, so my 20 can shoot at their gun. I gonna get my reinforcements. <laughs> Like I said, I got one skirmisher here, so we can keep an eye on this alley here. And we got I gotta hit him and him. I gotta decide with these three if they were to do an attack. I don't know if they're going to get more over here, so th these guys have to stay here. And I'm supposed to get my second core, which is all rookies. And I don't know how this is going to turn out. Um, let me see. The supply wagon is just going to hide over there. Uh, they already moved in their artillery and it's protected by infantry, so I cannot get at it.
Hey. Hey, boy, this got ugly. Everybody shoot that guy right there. Man, jeez. Okay, hold, hold. Come on, when is it? I gotta get by mind. Ish. I wonder what they think it. Oh boy, I don't know what to do because the, the, their infantry is all near their artillery. <laughs> Oh boy.
Yikes. Well, it's going to take a long time for the 20 pounder to take out that gun over there. I'm going to see if my cavalry can come down and help. And I don't know when I'm going to get my reinforcements at the end of this phase, maybe, but... So I'd like those rookies to get into the battle. I'm using all my best units here. Alright, well, it's probably not worth what I just did there to try to knock that gun out, but... Okay, well, we lost, you know, whatever. He, he killed 634 and he lost, he had about 315, so he lost, you know, quite a bit, but that's, I just had to try something, so I was getting tired of those guns shooting at my guys. And we knocked that gun out. Oh, it's like a standstill right here, you know, oh, boy. Meanwhile, uh, over here it's all nice and calm. It looks like the only ones engaging are, you know, the 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 the, the artillery. That's it. And I think uh, my, um, my skirmishes, this one here is, he's doing okay. Uh, this one,
Oh, and this 20 pounder. He's still shooting at him. How can he be tired? He's got 58 p condition. Okay, good. We must hold till the end of day. Finally. Oh, and they're going to get more. Oh, boy. Well, I'm glad I kept these units here then. All right. We're going to go ahead and save um, just for the heck of it. BG. N10A, I guess. And look, oh yeah, finally got my... Okay, so now where are the other reinforcements of the enemy going to come from? Okay, well, um, let's see. We got, wow, three hours, okay. So he's starting to shoot. He's confident. And right, we're gonna just put, shoot right into him. I got, I got a group going that way just in case and the rest of the group is going this way I don't know. So they're, they're there.
No, we, we probably could fall back. Yeah, I think I'm going to fall back. Cons consolidate the force. I don't know what to do at this point. Um, gonna get them all. Boy, this is a long battle. And you need to get over here, by my friend. Alright, so that unit that was stubborn right here, he's right here, he gave up. What did he have? Rebores. Alright, we're going to get the rookies to go forward.
<laughs> These two are still shooting at him. <laughs> These guns are at least going to get a little bit of experience. As a matter of fact, the cab is just sitting here shooting at him. And so are these rookies. Alright, so now I'm gonna re I'm gonna withdraw these guys over to here. Matter of fact, I'm gonna tell them to go attach and attach. I don't know where they'll go, but uh, I'm now I better get them in here first, because if they walk off this way, the enemy will be here and they'll hit them. So we'll do that. I figure this wave over here, let them come to us. Because by that time, these rookies will be there to. Because I want them to absorb it. And he's going out, so he's the third infantry unit that will be withdrawing. Like I said, any little bit that these guys do will be, you know, better than nothing. And this rookie cavalry unit is, you know, getting free shots, I guess. I'd probably dismount him and he'll shoot better, probably. Oh, they're already here. Oh, it's taking a long time for these guys to get here.
20 pounds to try to kill that gun over there still can't. I can't believe it. Come on. Alright, let's go ahead and go forward. Okay, well, um, that guy's dead. Put the. All right, come on, Cav. Like I said, my other Cav is over here, but like I said, he 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 lost quite a bit. But this Cav's a rookie Cav, so. You know, we can risk it. Okay, now you shoot at him. I'm really, oh, I want to just, like, I can't believe that this 20 pound, oh, he's out of ammo. I'm going to have to get ammo over to him. Okay, well, like I said, um, this is a rookie unit. And, like I said, he's a rookie, and so is he. But if he's not going to turn to shoot at him, then my calf can get some free shots. He's just going to have to absorb the bullets. so the all the three rookie infantry units are here right here so so and then we got backup of the guys that were already fighting the veterans let's see he wants to try to sneak over
like I said, my guns could be shooting at the infantry and get better kills, but I got both of these uh, Napoleons shooting at that gun right there. And we are wearing him down. I mean, I don't think one unit should be able to penetrate us. <laughs> They're gonna have to send a lot more than that. Okay, now what's going on over here? You charge into him, you charge into him, you charge into him. Hey, and that, that gun is gone, so now... Alright. Okay, so that rookie got that rookie got taken off the line, so I'm gonna have to put a veteran on. But, you know, I mean at least got him some experience by the way I look at it. <laughs> Oh, here comes some more units, but it's alright.
<laughs> they got more guns coming. Okay, we're going to have to... Okay, so what we're going to do is uh, consolidate our forces again. Um, Yeah, we're gonna have to. They're building up over here, so we gotta. Let me think about this for a minute. We need one unit to go there. He wants to charge. I mean, he's pretty brave wanting to come in like this because, you know, we got all this right here. And, and, the, and the 24 is now in a position to open up on him. And the 20 pounder can go right there. Fall back. And Wal Walton's right here too. And Grant. And Porter. All three of these guys are going to shoot at him. Yeah, I didn't. I didn't think he could withstand um, coming in like that on the river, and where, where all these units are right here. I mean, I don't know how he he could do that. He thought. I think he thought he, we were weak here, and here they come again.
Yeah, I don't think. Now, of course, I don't know if they're going to get any more reinforcements, but I would think this should be it. Prior first BD surrendered. Oh, somebody surrendered. All right, so I put um, this guy Barton onto the, the line again because. He's that rookie that was there, and he can go back. You can see that he's lost more than what he's killed, but, you know, it is what it is. So we're just going to, again, hold the line. I don't... I don't know if any other thing going on other than this right here yeah so this this rookie here he's got 50 courage he's got 50. He could go right there and get some better um, cover. So here they come again. up there. I'm going to get my cab to go up here to get some ammo. And we still got an hour and a half, so I mean, if he can fill up and then still get here and shoot at him, that would be much better if he has ammo. There's somebody over here.
Alright, so York He's um gonna get some ammo and he's a hundred percent, so that's good. Give him another couple of minutes and he should be, you know, hopefully full. Now I hear some more charges. Look at that! So this is a, this is a gun went off. <laughs> he, he gave up. He gave up. Another reboard muskets. Well, it's better than the 42s, I tell you. That was funny. Man, taking a long time to fill up York. I mean, he's right next to the supply wagon. Like seriously. You gotta give them A for effort for trying. I mean, coming into like these guns, I mean, I, this is a field six. This is a Napoleon, and this is a Napoleon. And, and this field six is shooting into him. And this 20 is supposed to be shooting at that unit right there. I mean... I have three guns shooting at him. Like he, he, there's no way he should be able to be like that. He, there's no way he could come in. Ah, he's gone. All right, let's get the rookie back on here. Alright, you gotta be full of ammo pr pretty close. Get over here, please.
All right, so let's see uh, York if he can, you know, just get some free shots here. Now this guy, he is a rookie. He's, you know, he's got 400. I mean, it's not bad considering he's a rookie. He's got 456 kills and he's lost 246. Okay, all guns. All guns on him. Oh, I knew I knew he couldn't take that. There's no way, right? Okay, so I got the 20, the 20 is shooting at him, this one is shooting at that guy there, and then I put both of these onto Jackson, and then this one onto him, so that's all the guns, and then I'm going to get the 24 over here, which he's going to go right, right there. I gotta give them some experience. All right, I'm gonna get my other cab over here. I'm just gonna try to finish this guy off, you know, like, and and actually, this is a rookie um, cavalry unit, so if if he can actually get the kill. Um, you know, that'll give him some good melee where he's more of a rifle guy, so, you know. As soon as he gets here, he's going to put six rounds into him, and that's going to be the end of that. Come on, Quinn, which I know Quinn got wounded or killed, but there's another officer that they put in, because... Yeah, there, there, see, just one round, just one round. Now, now get him. Get him. Finish him off. And they, they just finished him off, too. Wow, they just finished him off. Nice. Well, can I get, maybe I can get, uh, maybe I can get York over here to knock out their gun, maybe. But 
Quinn is going to come in here because I, I don't want to lose any more of him because that's expensive. Have these guys come up here to protect that. He might, he might take a canister before he reaches him. Got him. All right, and like I said, this will give him, no, he's gonna, sh he's gonna probably shoot him, but I mean, this will give him some melee. It's not the best melee with whatever rifle he's got, but yeah, melee is only 50. Oh wow, it's a supply wagon right here. I didn't see it. Alright, so even if he gets a shot off, if I get that supply wagon and then I go after Long Street. Alright, they got seven guns left. Come on! Oh, you got shot by their gun. You're still getting shot by their gun. Alright. Alright, I'm gonna run them because they're rookies. Alright, so I must have got all their supply wagons. <laughs> yeah, we're just gonna put the charge on. We're gonna just, you know, they're rookies, so they can get hurt, it don't matter. I want to take out that gun before the 30 minutes goes by. <laughs> Because this battle is going to end in 29 minutes. Yeah, 
Yeah, so unfortunately, you know, we probably lost a hundred guys um, during that little exchange of him constantly shooting at him. So, you know, it was a chance I took to get that supply wagon. And then he just gave up. Like I said, this, this has got to be over. Okay, so these rookies are gonna shoot at uh, Jackson. I mean, this has got to be over. And he's leaving. So, um, it's going to be 20 minutes left. Closing minutes of the final part of the battle here. Like I said, I, I'm pretty happy with what York had done in this battle, you know? I mean, he, he was a total rookie, so... I hope he, he he should be able to get. I mean, with 500 kills, I mean he should be able to get a per. I'm just trying to get these uh, these rookies here. Final shots. I guess Barton lost quite a bit, but I kept putting him on the line. <laughs> Alright, can we can we kill Jackson or somebody? Please, somebody. Anybody. Shoot him. Well, like I said, um, with all the changes that they've made to this, which, you know, caught me off guard a little bit, but overall, I mean, I think this went okay. I mean, I don't know how many I lost, but, you know, I don't know how it's going to look like in the camp, but nonetheless, um, nine minutes left.
That boy's gonna shoot long street. Yeah, so I'm glad that I put all the rookies in the second core because, like I said, uh, we I would have got squashed in this if I had those all those rookies to be in the whole battle. I mean, surprisingly, he's he's still a nice number. He's a good number. I mean, the only one that really took a beating was this guy because of them always wanting to attack the guy that was right here. You know, so he, but, but, you know, I mean, he did kill 200, but he lost most. Got five minutes left. Come on, guys. Yeah, so they got 547, the guy that that withdrew over here somewhere. And I got... Okay, so we got we f four, four infantry shooting at Long, Long Street. Along with this 24-pounder. And this Field 6. And, and uh, this uh, Napoleon, along with this Napoleon, he can move. Okay, right, we got one minute. Boy, Longstreet must have a lot of troops in his, uh, in his company. I mean, I know these are rookies, so they're not going to get much on kills, but still. Oh. I mean, when you consider, the only one they see is him, and even all the guns, that's all they see is him. There, now he's gone. And that should be it, right there, yep. So they only had one infantry unit left, and maybe one uh, general, that was about it. So yeah, so they actually, they actually did have more than what I had. 27. Uh, that's, well, that's probably because of the splits. It's got to be because of the splits. Yep. All right, well, okay, so this is a grand battle, and I was curious about going into this. Didn't know, you know, if I could win it, but I did, and... Lost about 5,000. Says killed 11 and wounded 3,250. 539 missing. Whatever. Okay. That's all she wrote. I held all points. These are all the units. Oh, it's a whole lot. Officers? So, hey, York. York got promoted. The rookie... The rookie cavalry. Yeah, and remember these guys? Um... I, I bought a few of these or whatever to make them and and they all they got promoted now we did lose this guy and we lost this guy and we lost this one two Hillary two Hillary bass that's kind of weird and this guy got promoted and we got some promotions so I you know overall, Yeah, and those supply wagons, even though I used them, there was one that I that I got up at the top that I didn't use much, but he was just with my broken calf that I had there. 
So that's probably this one or this one. Or this is the one that probably was caught over here, maybe. I don't know, because think about it. He came in with the last wave. So whatever. But they did have three three sets of guns over here that could have sucked up a lot of that. So I don't really know which is which, but we got four of them. So that's quite a bit right there. Recovered Springfields. Recovered some Lorenz. So yeah, not, not much in goods though, as far as that goes. All right, let's see what this looks like. This is the part that I was curious about. All right, so we get 12,000 there, we get 200,000, we get two career points, we get 15 rep. We captured 4,300 and we get 1,500 back, so. And on top of all that, we get Porter. Porter survived. And because he's a brigadier now, we get our second perk. So I'll go with accuracy. And as far as um, reserve of uh, veterans, we got 1,500. So could I get him? No, I can't. Look. Cancel. He's going to just have to stay like that. Because I cannot... Um, you know, I cannot... I, I don't want to lose the perk. So, unfortunate now. As far as this guy goes... Yeah, see, because even he'll lose a little. But I'll get him to full strength. And actually, um, let, before I do anything else, let me go ahead and save. BG North 10. And that's what I'll say. Yeah, okay. That way, you know, like, because let's take a look and see. We got, oh, we got Malvin coming up next. And that's another, okay, so that's another 20 and 10. And that's all I got is 20 and 10. So that would mean that, yeah, unless I lost the unit. Okay, well, all right, let me do this. Let me see if I can get. Yeah, right. Cause see, if I put if I put veterans into these lesser units, we can get their first uh, perk. Ah, uh, but he's he must have been in a position to do to do absolutely nothing. So I'm gonna have to make him. I don't really like having big units, but I'll make him 1450 just to give him his first perk. Yeah. All right, so then I've got to make sure I got to make sure first of all all the guns are okay. Oh yeah, I can buy some. Okay, so he's now got eight guns. And then where is my... Oh, 
Oh, there's my calf. Oh, man. Yeah, see? Ah, oh, jeez. What am I going to do? Ay. Done. How much we have left? We have nine. Oh, man, this hurts. I guess what I could do is just give it up, I guess. He'll get it back. We'll just go to 300. I'm just gonna have to use him very spare, sparingly, and it's not Quinn anymore. Like, wait, a minute, let me see if oh, it is Quinn. Yeah, so so he got wounded, but he's he's already back. So he says he's been in for seven battles. So that's really good. Uh, cancel. Yes, sir. Yeah, I'm just going to have to keep him at 300. And I have to be very sparingly with him. So let me get him back up to 200. Get him back up to 200. And the 20's already been checked. These two guns have been checked. Everybody else can be left alone for the moment and now I'm gonna check this gun and we'll just get him to 12 cancel ten And then York. Ah, so York, I can, I can gain with York because he's he's not. But I'm gonna get him back up to 400, and he gets his first one now. Let me think about this. Let me look at these for a moment. Yeah, I'm I'm gonna have to go with this. I I I want speed and and stuff like that. I you know. On the second perk, I can then branch out to something different. But I think that'll be good for York. And he just got his, so he's gonna have to get. Oh, here's another one that didn't. Oh, but giving him... All right, well, well, that actually works out. Because, you know, having at least one perk... Having at least one perk, at least, you know, they are nice and good. And then this guy, I have to do the same. Otherwise, he won't have the perk. Oh, and we don't even have enough. How much is left? 293. But he'll still retain it. All right, I can't believe it. Yeah, I can't believe it. Everybody has got a star. So now all we can do is 
use rookies. We're just going to get to full strength is all we're going to do. Now him I can't, but we got, we got, I mean, we have to give it up. I mean, it's just the way it is. I mean, it, it, it always sucks, but that's the way, you know, that's the way JMP made it, like, with this this new veteran pool and things. So, like I said, generally I like playing with tw uh, 12, 1250. Sir, yes, sir! I mean, that way scaling ain't out of hand and stuff like that. And, and, I, and of course, we don't know how scaling works now. I mean, I, at least I don't. Oh, let me, let me see. Uh, he's going to lose a lot. But, like I said, as long as they keep that perk, um, I'm willing to do it. Yes, sir. Because I, you know, you you need the I need these thirty units. <laughs> Ain't no sense in making any other units or crap trashing these or whatever. Now, let me see what other rifles I have. Yeah, nothing. So yeah, we're gonna have to buy them. I mean, even buying these, you know, um, Okay, so it looks like um, we are at a uh, full strength. And if you look at the armory here, this is all that we have left. Okay, well, let me think before I do this, but um, career-wise... Minus 35 cost of veteran recruits. Three stats for re recruits. Plus seven minimum replacement officer XP. Mm-hmm. 
Yeah, so you'd have to you'd have to go you'd have to put all two points in here to get to that eight. So mm. I'm gonna go with uh, I'm going with medicine. So I have medicine, training, and reconnaissance at six. I'll just try it. What the heck? So, because I could have bought economy to buy those those guns, but you know what? I'm just gonna buy what I would normally buy. So I'll buy I'll buy the James. I'll buy these two. I'll buy this just to make one unit of that eventually. And the same here. And that's all that I'll buy from there because all this is going to be gone after the next ba battle. And then I just buy the JF Browns. That's it. And I don't quite... I do have 10 parrots. Um, do I make one of these? Do I make one of these a parrot? And if I buy two, I mean, I, don't buy, I mean, I have two. So if I get to ten, I give up. Of course, I'm going to give up experience, but yes, sir. This way, I will have a counter counter battery. Not as good as the twenty, but you know, it's. You know, I'll, this way I'll have, you know, I, I don't know how I'll do it throughout the, the whole campaign if I keep going. But um, I can tell you that, uh, you know, as long as I have the guns, you know, I, I'll probably make, keep one unit like this, I guess. So that, that I, I, okay, so that's, okay, now as far as officers go, let me see. Yeah, I mean, why not? All right, I got all the officers now. Um, And the lowest guys that are in the battles are these guys, it's majors or whatever. So that's it. Um, I believe I'm ready for the next battle, which is the grand battle. So that is it. Uh, I don't think we can, can't, we can't, we can't up the that because I didn't put it in the right field. So. Um, we just need 30 units again, so this is what's perfect, is all, uh, whatever I had to spend on uh, losing XP, I can possibly gain it all back and plus more on the next battle. So that's the way I'm going to look at it. I still have 90,000. I could buy some rifles. Um, you, know, may, you know, maybe, maybe I could. Um, Could I, for example, yeah, see, could I um, make, make one unit, give one unit this. 
Like for him. I can give him the Lorenz. That way, that way, um, you know, we have one extra unit that has a, a good rifle. So that's the way I'm going to look at it. Now, according to, and the way I look at it is, see how they have the 61 here and then the Hopper's Ferry? So whatever stat here makes it that way, to me they're trying to say that a Hopper Ferry is better than a Springfield 61, just like a Lorenz is better than all of these. So I mean, it's the way I've always done it in the game where I, I look at it in the order that the rifles are. Not necessarily are they the very best, it's just that... That's so I just want to mention that that's the way I look at it. So, so in other words, this this group has Lorenz. Then we have uh, Springfield 61s, but they're saying Springfield 61s are not the best. So I'm gonna just look at whoever has. I mean, it's a it's a toss up between. Okay, so this guy. Just for the heck of it, I'm going to give him the Hopper Fairy. And then that means somebody here can have a Springfield. So he's at 25, 26, 25. 27, 26 of 27. So he'll be the unit that gets the uh, Springfield 61. And I got a boost of 8, so it's possible that I could buy something. So... So yeah, um, Okay, so then if I do that, I still have a morale boost of three. And then that means I can go ahead and give another unit a Lorenz. And it, and it'll actually, I wonder, I wonder if I could buy some more. Let me see. No, I can't. I need 29,000. So could I get rid of all of these? Could I get rid of all those? I mean, this is really, you know, messing around, but let me just see if I could do it. Ah, right, so. Hey. 
pen by doing that, that gives me this many 61s. And so now these units... Well, he's a big unit, so, you know... Yeah, suppose I give him the 61s. Yeah, because this guy's got him, so I have that there, and then... Yes, sir. All right, I give him a Springfield 61. And I give... I give him a Springfield 61. Nope, that costs a lot of money, so we'll just give him a reboard. And we'll give this guy... Well, he's already got it, so he's got the reboard. Okay, now that is the absolute... Everything that I could possibly do. Um, I don't have... I don't have anything else that I would... Because I don't want to buy anything anyway, but I mean, of, of what I already bought, so. So yeah, so this is the way it's going to go down. So this is the way it is. So, no matter where you are in the world, I want you to have a great day, a great afternoon, or a great evening. Please take care of yourself. Be kind to others. God bless to you and your own religion. This is your friend, Jeff, signing out of Ultimate General Civil War with the North. Adios amigos and adios the lovely amigos.